Hey man, what it do, y'all, man? It's your big dog, Thump. And you tune into another installment of Thump Talks. And today, I want to know. Y'all seen the thumbnail, right? I want to know. Did Bobby Smurder and Roddy Rebel keep it too real? I want to know that they keep it too real. And that's why I'm saying this. Because you got folks like 6ix9ine, Gunner, and a slew of other folks who got rap allegations on their jacket, right? And it seems that, you know, they're able to prosper and, and still, you know, have some type of influence on, 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 on the culture. Um, and I may I may be stretching it though, you know, I may be stretching it, but it seems to me that the rats are more relevant than than the guys who really stood up, you know, and really stand, and, you know, really stood on ten. And um, you know, so for me, I want to know from y'all did Bobby Smurder and Roddy Rebel and the rest of the GS9 crew keep it too real? Because we got folks out here praising rats. They clicking up with rats, they getting money with them. Um, they still able to um, enjoy life. And, and by no means am I telling y'all to go out here and crash out and, and um, you know, do anything that's going to, uh, you know, cause y'all to mess up y'all life. You know what I'm saying? So I'm, I'm not saying that, you know, because I'm not going to do that. But one thing I'm not going to do is I'm not going to support nothing them guys doing by no means. You know, I'm not finna, I'm not finna, I'm not finna, you know, uh, glorify nothing they doing or, or, or try to uh, justify it, which I see a lot of folks doing. You know, they try to justify the, uh, what 6 9 done, saying that he was uh, bullied or, 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 they, or, or, they, or they slept with his baby mama or they kidnapped him. That man knew what he was getting himself into before he got into it. So, you know, he could have he, he could have just, you know, he, he could have just done what he was doing. He was doing rock and roll or some shit, um, heavy metal or something before he, he started rapping. He could have kept doing that, you know. But but he want to he wanna feed off these cultures, man. He want to feed off the black culture. He want to feed off the Latin culture now. You know, now he want to make Latin music, give out money and all this crap, all this book, all this BS to, 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 to Colombia and Cuba and, and Venezuela and all that. He want to go to these countries now and try to feed off of this, this bad bunny uh, phenomenon. You feel me? But uh, we see right through that, man. Um, Bobby Schmurda and um, Roddy Rebel, you know, they're some stand up guys. So I'm going to salute y'all boys, man. You know, if y'all was to come across this video. You know what I'm saying? You know, um, just know that, 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 that real soldiers and real reputables, man, and real individuals, man, you know, out here in America, man, and, and all over the world, man, still, you know, hold y'all in high regard for standing on y'all ten like that, you know. Uh, when most when most would have broke, man, they would they would have they would have they would have shattered, you feel me? Um, they wouldn't have followed protocol. And not to say there's protocol in the streets no more, because the streets is dead. And I advise anybody who playing them streets, man, to get out while they're getting good. Um, it's no pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. So get out now while the getting is good, you feel me? Um, most, um, excuse me, most of y'all kids out here, most of y'all, the youth, don't understand that this is only a, a small chapter of your life. You know what I'm saying? It's a small chapter. It's not the whole chapter, you feel me? It's not the whole book, I mean. You, you got a wide range of, of life to live out here, man, you know? And life is short. It's too short for y'all to be crashing out, man, in your twenties and your teen, early teen, your mid teens, and all that, man. It's, it's life is too short for y'all to be doing that, man. So, so wise up, man. You know, um, I'm not finna make a long video, man. You know, I don't ever do that. I try to get out here in, you know, five or ten minutes, man. You know, just to get my point across. But I definitely want to hear from y'all in the comment section. Uh, I want y'all to tap in with me. But um, y'all, y'all just know, man, that life is short. So. Be mindful of what you do today. Cause like I say, what you do today gonna predict the future. You know? 
Um, so I just want to know, man, did, did Bobby Smurda and, and, and Roddy Rebel keep uh, Roddy Rebel keep it too real, man? You know, that's what I want to know. Um, I feel like those boys, man. You know, I feel like they some you know some stand up dudes, man. You know, uh, for doing what they done, man. You know, they 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 knew what the, they knew what they was doing. They knew the game they was playing, and they played it all the way out. You feel me? On six nine, on the other hand, no, he didn't. Gunner, on the other hand, no, he didn't. Um, uh, what that what that dude out of Florida, man? Um, um Boston Richie. Um, there's some stuff surrounding Boston Richie. I'm gonna be honest, I like Boston Richie music, man. And, I, and I'd be lying to you if I say I didn't. I like his music, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, if, 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 if that's true, and I haven't dug too deep on it, because I think I like his music a little too much, but um, I didn't kind of, I'm weaning myself off of it, you know what I'm saying? But if Boston Richie done what he done, then, then he deserved to be in that boat with 6 9 and Gunner as well. And the rest of them, you feel what I'm saying? So, y'all get in that comment box, man. Like, share, and subscribe. Tune in. Um, YouTube had banned me for a week. You know what I'm saying? A week and some change. So I was banned. Um, excuse the lightning here, man. I'm, I'm trying to, you know, trying to do my one-two in here. But um, YouTube had banned me, man. So, you know, y'all excuse me, man. You know, I'm back now. Um, for those who subscribe to my channel, I appreciate it. Uh, we hit, we hit the um, 100 subscriber mark, so I want to go ahead and, uh, you know, we're on the road to 200 now. So I appreciate y'all, man, and thank y'all for rocking with your boy, man. I definitely appreciate it. This is a big dog thump. I'm out. Let's go.